Welcome to the 33-day consecration to St. Joseph. Today is day number 22 for St. Joseph as the patron of the dying. The death of St. Joseph is not recorded in the Gospels. However, we do know that he was not present during the crucifixion of Jesus. And according to church tradition, Joseph most likely died before the beginning of Jesus' public ministry. It is believed that St. Joseph died a holy and happy death, gazing upon Jesus and resting in the arms of Mary. What a blessed death to see God before you die and for God himself to tell you to go. This was Joseph's gift from his son who would hand his father over to his father. Thus Christ entrusted Joseph a particular intercessory power for all those at the moment of death. St. Joseph's death is a touching and desirable example to us. God has designated St. Joseph as the patron of the dying because he wants us to experience a death similar to that of St. Joseph, a holy and happy death. Death is a part of life, but letting go and saying goodbye to family and friends is not easy. However, we need to be prepared for death because Satan always tries to get a soul to despair and turn away from our loving God at the hour of death. Ask any priest. He will tell you that a spiritual battle takes place over a soul at the hour of death. However, St. Joseph can help us to make our death beautiful. The example of his passing encourages us not to fear death because the holy protecting powers that hovered near the saint's deathbed are at our command, especially through the means of grace given us by Mother Church and Holy Viaticum, the Eucharist given to someone who is near death. Therefore, when we die, we should surely benefit by praying to St. Joseph to help usher us to eternity. Moreover, we can ask St. Joseph to intercede for a family member or friend who might be close to the end of his or her life. O glorious St. Joseph, behold, I choose thee. Today is my special patron in life and at the hour of my death. Preserve and increase in me the spirit of prayer and fervor in the service of God. Remove far from me every kind of sin. Obtain for me that my death may not come upon me unawares, but that I may have time to confess my sins sacramentally and to bewile them with the most perfect understanding and a most sincere and perfect contrition, in order that I may breathe forth my soul into the hands of Jesus and Mary. Amen. In a few moments, we'll pray this litany to St. Joseph. Our daily challenge today is to know that life is busy, and we often don't stop and contemplate the final things of life such as death. Set aside some quiet time today to contemplate your own mortality and your own death. Invite Joseph, Mary, and the Holy Trinity to meet you there and help you prepare in this lifetime for uniting them and with them in eternity. May Almighty God bless and protect you and your family. May St. Joseph intercede for you, the patron saint of the dying. And may Almighty God bless you, the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. May God bless you and your family, and I look forward to seeing you tomorrow. Our Litany to St. Joseph. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Christ hear us, Christ graciously hear us. God the Father of heaven, have mercy on us. God the Son, Redeemer of the world, have mercy on us. God the Holy Spirit, have mercy on us. Holy Trinity, one God, have mercy on us. Holy Mary, pray for us. Saint Joseph, pray for us. Noble offspring of David, pray for us. Light of Patriarchs, pray for us. Spouse of the Mother of God, pray for us. Chaste Guardian of the Virgin, pray for us. Foster Father of the Son of God, pray for us. 
zealous defender of Christ, pray for us. Head of the Holy Family, pray for us. Joseph Most Just, pray for us. Joseph Most Chase, pray for us. Joseph Most Prudent, pray for us. Joseph Most Courageous, pray for us. Joseph Most Obedient, pray for us. Joseph Most Faithful, pray for us. Mirror of Patience, pray for us. Lover of Poverty, pray for us. Model of Workman, pray for us. Glory of Domestic Life, pray for us. Guardian of Virgins, pray for us. Pillar of Families, pray for us. Comfort of the Afflicted, pray for us. Hope of the Sick, pray for us. Patron of the Dying, pray for us. Terror of Demons, pray for us. Protector of the Holy Church, pray for us. Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world, spare us, O Lord. Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world, graciously hear us, O Lord. Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. He has made him Lord of his household and prince over all his possessions. Let us pray, O God, who in your loving providence chose blessed Joseph to be the spouse of your most holy mother, grant us in the favor of having him for our intercessor in heaven, whom on earth we venerate as our protector. You who live and reign forever and ever. Amen.